Hello there, I'm Black Bright, broadcasting out of the UK, around the world, and welcome to my channel. Um, if you like what I do, please hit the subscribe button, share it with your friends and family members, and you can click on the like button if you think what I've said is to your liking. Um, basically, um, I have just received this information regarding about the TOEIC. For those of you who do not know what that is, it's the English test that the Home Office give to immigrants um, that will facilitate whether or not they're eligible to attend college or university in the UK. Now, you may remember a couple of months ago, I did a video on all of those um, students who had been accused of sending a proxy in to do the test. This was triggered by a panorama program. And as a result, a lot of um, students were wrongfully accused, deported, shamed because they were accused of cheating in the test. Now, um, some people, I don't even know if it's going to get to the students. I don't know if this video is going to reach students who have been affected abroad because what happened is once you've been deported, you cannot leave the country. It mars your reputation and it mars everything. So I'm hoping that this video will be widely shared to anyone who was wrongfully accused of cheating and whose reputation as a result has been tarnished. A lot of those people were unable to get a solicitor. But there is a BBC journalist by the name of Robert Watson who is investigating everyone who has been harmed and seeking to clean their immigration history so that there is no deception on it. Um, so let me just, um, all you need to do if you went, if you took the test at any of the following centres, centres between 2011 and 2014, that's the criteria, the years 2011 to 2014, and if you took the test at any ETS centre, either Queensway College, South Key College, Premier Training, sorry, Premier Language Training Centre, Synergy College, Colwell College, London School of Social Studies, College of Skills and Learning, Eden College International, Universal Training Center or Calden College. If you took the test at any one of those institutions, please write to Richard Watson. He's a BBC journalist. His email address is richard.watson at bbc.co.uk. I'll put it in the link below. And all you need to do is state the location you took the test and the date and then hopefully your immigration status can be cleaned so that you're free to travel and your at your reputation isn't tarnished i know there was a few people who was able to appeal who had enough money to get a lawyer but there was a lot who couldn't afford it and have are living at this moment in whichever country they were deported to with a tarnished reputation. So I hope you find this helpful. Like I said, please share it with all anyone you know who had, whose reputation has been tarnished by being accused of cheating or sending a proxy. Please, if you um, are not 100% sure you have to be 100% sure that you didn't, that you're absolutely clean and you are not guilty in order to apply for this. So it doesn't mess up the system. So nobody should be jumping on the bandwagon with this. It should really be for authentic claimants. So I do wish you luck. And yes, if you have any luck, please put your comments at the bottom of the video so that I know that this video has helped someone. And that's all for now. Bye bye.